Hey, what's up everybody? Got a big construction update for you today, so bear with me on this video here. I've had a lot of people writing in asking about everything that's going on around here. I'm all the way down South Church Street by the uh, by the Walmart where the new Aldi's is going in, so uh, bear with me on this video. Here we go. Obviously, starting with uh, the Aldi's, uh, as you can see, they're almost done. The inside's coming along. They're about to paint it, so that's why I'm not in there right now. They're putting up the signs and all the exterior work right now. Uh, hopefully, opening sometime in April. They didn't give me a definitive date because, again, with all the construction and delays and certain things going on, they're hoping for April. But if it pushed back a little bit, you know, that's just nature of the beast right now. But they're shooting for April. So um, then phase two further back over there still got the dollar tree they haven't uh, broken ground or anything like that i'll give you an update on that as it comes and then yes um, i was told wendy's purchased one of the lots further down so they're looking at a wendy's here uh, and that's there's multi more there's many more phases uh to this spot right here and i'll give you updates on those as they come and now jumping over to the other side of walmart over there now we're over here on the back side of Walmart. As you can see, this is the gas station that's being built. You got Walmart over there and Aldi's on the far side over there. Here is South Church Street running right here all the way to Shelbyville that way. Uh, but uh, this is obviously a gas station. It's a racetrack gas station. And I was told the uh, expected completion date of construction is right at the end of March, provided everything goes well. As you can see, the building is almost done and they're putting in the gas lines and the tanks and all that stuff like that gentleman right there. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so gas station, Expected completion date, end of March. There you go. Now, turning around, on the other side, this is Tiger Hill right here. On the other side, right there, is a uh, new Pet Boys Auto Shop that's going in. Now, this is going to be a full-service auto shop. They've got all kinds of bays there. Uh, above each bay, it's going to say brakes, tires, you know, transmission, engine work, all that sort of stuff. Those two right there, I believe, are the heavy-duty ones. They're going to have two 10-ton uh, auto lifts in there. And the um, expected completion date that they're going to turn this completely over to Pet Boys when they're done is April 19th. Uh, the weather kind of threw a wrench into all that. It was actually March 17th was the expected finish date. Uh, but like I said, weather, snow, the snowpocalypse, all that sort of stuff. Um, if, if many of you have drove driven by this place when that happened, you saw the roof caved in, all kinds of stuff. So they have been hauling butt to get this all caught up and done, which they're doing a phenomenal job at. And so expect to complete today, April 19th. They're going to turn it over to Pet Boys and open up about a week later. So now going up Tiger Hill that way. Now up here at the top of Tiger Hill, you can probably hear them. They're, they're drilling right now. There's a guy on the other side of that propane tank right there breaking up a bunch of rock they're doing right now. But uh, if you remember, we did an update here a long time ago with the townhome update. Well, I got a further update for you. Uh, this is the main road that comes in at the top of Tiger Hill to the new um, the new air, the townhome community that's going to be here. There's going to be 68 townhomes that they're going to build. And on either side, this is the main road right here. So when you come up the hill, you can, oop, there we go. <laughs> Let me turn around. There you go. We got the side hill here and the main hill here. Sorry. And when you come up the hill into the main entrance right here, there's going to be two out, uh, two buildings, one on either side, which they're going to, it's going to be like the pet boys down over there that I just reported on. They don't know what's going to go there just yet, but there are going to be two buildings right here and then drive past that into the townhome community where there's going to be 68 townhomes in total. And then it's just, they don't have an expected completion date. They've been drilling since May to break up all this rock, and they said they're about halfway done because they're going to bring this whole entire hill down about 15 more feet uh, in order to build out these townhomes. So uh, that's what's going on up here. Uh, that's the whole update for you for everybody that's been writing and asking. Uh, as soon as I have more updates, there they go, more drilling. Um, I'll do some more updates for you as, uh, as all this comes to fruition. And so there you go. So thanks for watching as always. I appreciate it. And like I always say, go put a smile on somebody's face today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.